So this is how we can view raw photos and images on Android. Let's begin. So the raw photos can be taken in the professional mode inside of the camera. So depends on your specific device. But if you get to the professional mode, you can cap capture a photo, which is going to be with much more information. It's going to be the raw, as it's called, you know, which is uh, like ready for edits later. However, it then just appears in the camera, I mean, in the gallery app, normally as any other picture. So you can view it in there. What's also a good idea is to open up the settings and locate at the camera section directly, where if you just look up the raw photo or keyword, it gives you the ability to enable raw copies. So not only you capture the raw photo inside of your gallery, but also a JPEG alongside with it, with all of the edits and like, you know, basic uh, like edits. And it's not going to be, you know, raw photo, of course. So it's going to be a JPEG saved inside of the gallery as well. So you might end up just with two different pictures. So that's kind of how it works. You know that you can view them directly inside of the gallery app, but for some additional edits, it's always a good idea to get a third party app, which is like made for this. So there is the Snapseed from Google or there is Lightroom from Adobe, both great apps. You can even go for something a little bit different like Raw Droid, which is a specific dedicated like raw uh, material editing app. So you can go ahead and get something like that. And with that much of information captured in a photo, you can do a lot of different edits and like, yeah, end up with really nice results. So that's it. That's uh, what I wanted to show you in uh, this video. Thanks a lot for watching and your support. Hopefully you found this uh, like useful. Hit the thumbs up if you did and subscribe for more so you'll never miss anything important in the next videos.